Alright, so, went back to town, warmed up, and we're back out here in the frozen waste. So, without further ado, let's, uh, get inside. This is cold. And I found some snowberries and made a snowberry extract, so I could get, uh, in the frigid water, which did happen. I fell into the water, and it was really cold, so... Let's do a little torch here so we can dry off while we're talking to Septimus. Dig, dwemer in the beyond. When the top level was built, eh? no more could be placed. It was and Yes, maximal apex, yep. I've inscribed the lexicon. Give it quickly. Extraordinary. I see it now. The ceiling structure interlocks in the tiniest fractals. Dwemer blood can loose the hooks, but none alive remain to bear it. Okay. A panoply of their brethren could gather to form a facsimile. A trick. Something they did not anticipate. No, not even them. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer, Dunmer, Falmer, and Orsimer. The elves still living provide the key. Bear you hence this extractor. It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when its set is complete. Okay, so I was given an extractor to harvest the blood of all the different elf types to fake it. Okay. Essence extractor. So maybe this happens automatically or something, because you can't equip it. Okay. Um then you can get inside there. I'm curious to see what's in there. My feet were set upon the rock, but it turned to mud and drove me down. Dude, you have a bit of an infestation. What? What on earth is that? Okay, cautious. Oh, you are cre creepy. You're not hostile. Speak with wretched abyss. Come closer. Ugh. Bashed in my presence. Are you getting bigger, dude? Get get out of my head. Ugh, tentacles. Yuck. Who are you? I am Hermaeus Mora. I am the guardian of the unseen and knower of the unknown. I have okay. been watching you, mortal. You must have quite the story to tell. Most impressive. Maybe you could tell me a bit about myself and I don't know. Um. What do you want from me? Your continuing aid to Septimus oh, renders him with your tentacles. increasingly obsolete. He has served me well, but his time is nearing its end. Once that infernal lockbox is opened, he will have exhausted his usefulness to me. Okay, this doesn't sound too good for when him. That time comes, Stop touching me. You shall take his place as my emissary. What say you? Dude, I don't want to spend more time with you. I'm your servant, my... No, I... I... Be <laughs> warned. Many have thought as you do. I have broken them all. You shall not evade me forever. Okay. Yeah. Yuck. Yuck, I just feel gross. Being around that thing. <laughs> Ugh, gosh, that was yuck. Anyway, on a side note, I like this cloak. <laughs> Look at it. It's white, like my skin. And we leveled up, so let's move on to that. Gross. Ah, I'm just grossed out now. 
Disgusting. Um, why am I having a ding to my magic? All right, let's do magicka. And how many points do I have in this? I only have one. Maybe that's why it's not doing as much damage. I I don't know. I'm really leery about using the uh, crossbow now. I don't think I'm going to. It's not very impressive. So one-handed weapons and unarmed attacks do 50% more damage. While unarmed, every hit does stamina damage. Blocked hits do additional stamina damage. Unarmed attacks deal five more damage. You may only use one discipline hurt. Okay, so stone fist discipline. All right, so this is kind of specializing in the uh, unarmed thing. 5% faster. So either 5% faster or 5 more damage. I think speed's going to be better. But the question is, should we go that route, right? Um, let's see. Speechcraft, alchemy. This would be helpful. What's this? Potions you mix, uh, store health, magicka, and stamina are 25% more powerful. That's nice. Um... Conjuration. I have no skill in this, and that spell was was uh, expert. The amunculi. That is way down the line. So I think we're just gonna have to kind of tough that one out and just get more magicka. I don't, I don't know how else to to do that. Restoration's good. Um, we're gonna need another point in alteration if we do those fire and uh, those other spells to enchant our weapon. Can I get that yet? Okay. It requires 30. So I'm going to do this. Apprentice Alteration. Alright. Um, i got a few more points so I can get to that. And we're going to do... Obviously the 50% damage. And the stamina stuff. Because I'd like to start working down, working down this line as well. And I'll probably go with 5% faster. If the target... If an arm attack carries a shield, you may steal it? What? You may steal the weapon? Oh my gosh, that's nuts. Huh. That's funny. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, okay. Well, let me equip that. Hey, hey. <laughs> Alright, now... Now we should talk about ideas for a companion, because now I've got that other... That other Hyperion deal. Um, should we have another companion? I guess that's a, that's a question. But who would it be? Because he's Falmer. Snow Elf, essentially. Oh, those are Reeklings? Reeklings? Yeah. Forget those stupid Reeklings. May have killed a few Horkers along the way. Just testing out the blade. What? what are they up here? Oh! What the? Oh, fire's not my friend! Fire's not my friend, okay. So, we'll wait on the fire resist, but let's do magic resist and fort fire. Am I hurting him? Okay, there was like no health bar there for a second. There we go, okay. Once again, life steal is good, but I'd like to do a bit more damage just outright, you know? With Ooh. my weapons in general. So essentially I'm I'm enchanting my fist. <laughs> How cool is that notion? Skeletons much! <laughs> Ugh, get out of here! Get out of here! Stop hitting me! Oh heal, 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 okay. Get him! There we go. Okay. How many of you guys are going to come back to life, huh? Okay. Loving the steam stuff. Oh! We've got a fire guy. we got a fire guy. Who are you? Okay, it's normal mage. He looked a little different. Do these mages have anything good? Eh. Oh, wait. Bone meal. 
Oh look, it's our friend. He must have uh, come over from from Morbus's playthrough. Idiot. Stupid skeleton. My goodness. What? Power attack. Yep. You're dead. Whoa! Whoa! What the frick was that? That was so loud. All right, all right. We got issues. Something's going on. Oh, the stupid rag people summon all those spiders, which are creepy, by the way. Not just because they're spiders, but they're like undead. There we go. Scale armor didn't do much good. Orc short bow. Thank you. Yay. Lock picking. My favorite. Come on. Nope, wrong direction. Oh, seriously. Seriously. Thank you. Oh, it actually leads into something. Who are you? Scourge. Okay, that was a lot of damage. It didn't get through. Come on, stun him. Stun him. Steam everywhere. Red stuff from stealing health. It's crazy that they, they can take a beating with that kind of armor on before the age of man. So, you know, my time. Oh my gosh, everything is locked. Come on. No trust. Hey, is anybody excited for Elder Scrolls Online? I am. Eh. I am. I think uh, my wife and I are going to get it. She's a pretty good gamer, actually. I say, actually, if you knew her and you didn't know she was a gamer, it would be a bit of a shock. It doesn't really have anything to do with the fact that she's a woman. It has to do with the fact that she's like an interior designer. And so when you hear that she plays video games, it's a little like, what? So, seriously, that's all that was in there? It's kind of weird. Your little, uh, whoa, little place. Okay, um, let's not die by falling. There are plenty more embarrassing ways for me to die that I've demonstrated already. So, you know, let's work on those. I'm just gonna fly across here. All right. So, to Alfton. To Alfton we go. How often are you here? No. Not what I meant to do. Um there we go. I cannot seem to see the the waypoints anywhere. Have you guys noticed that they just don't even show up? I don't know why. Hmm. Alright. Let's get, let's boogie. Let's get going. So yeah, I've been, uh, I was invited to the beta twice now, and it was actually a lot of fun. But I, it was also kind of like a little, uh, I was apprehensive to keep going because, I mean, why invest all that time into a character and then it just gets wiped? I don't know. It's kind of weird like that, I guess. Plus, I don't want to ruin anything for the release, and then it's like, okay, your weekend's over. Go back to whatever it is you're doing. You know what I mean? Oh! Family. But it was a lot of fun. I played as a Nord. Because, come on. You can't play Elder Scrolls without trying a Nord. At least I can't, because I was, uh, started my Elder Scrolls journey here in Skyrim. I didn't play Oblivion or Morrowind, or anything like that. So I say, of course you can't, because, in my mind, there is no Elder Scrolls without, without Skyrim. I hate these things. So hard to hit. 
course, I made short work of them, I guess, so it wasn't that bad. Um, but I played as, I think, I think my wife played as a Dunmer, the Dark Elves. And that was pretty cool, because you could, uh, like, summon a familiar. It was just a racial passive ability. Passive? No, just a racial ability, sorry. It didn't do it for you or anything like that. Oh, which reminds me, I should put autocast of whatever weapon enchant I'm going for when I enter combat. Oh, that would make life so much easier. I didn't even think about that till now. Who are you guys? Bandits. Awesome. Let's just see how tough you guys are. Come on. Don't fight left-handed. The blade's on the right. Oh, look at the, the wolves are coming in, too. Kind of, it's kind of weird just not seeing the blade when you're in first person. I don't know. There we go. Anyway, yeah. So I should have, I should set auto cast for the enchant that I've got right here once I'm in combat. Oh, did we not open this one? What? Uh that was stupid. Alright, one of these two, we I'm pretty sure we opened those. Gosh dang it. Fail. I jokingly said that, you know, oh we should call a series like really nerdy. Wait, treasure hunter. Hunter's note? What is this? There's something coming after me. I'm just gonna stop and uh, read this note. Excuse me, bad guys. Explore Lost Knight, Lost Knife Hideout. Broadsword of Flames. Okay. Interesting. Random. Is that part of the vanilla game? Oh no. Close the gap. Sit down. Um, no, this part of Elfton, that is a lighthouse, I think. Yeah, lighthouse. But let's, let's get going here. Sorry, I feel like the last episode and this one, I've been doing a lot of kind of maintenance-y goofing around, but the last one, I mean, we got the Hyperion Master. Like, come on, we had to show that off a little bit. Am I near Dawnstar? Okay, um, I should set a marker, huh? Move it. There we go. Alright, I'm heading in the right direction. Oh, who are you? Bandits. Seriously, bandits, I'm not worried about them. There we go. Heal up. Took a little bit of damage there, didn't I? They're all up there. Novice, blah! So sick of log picking. Hey, you've got all kinds of goodies. Got a dwarven shield on. Wait, were you guys like fighting and I interrupted the fight and now, now you're like, oh, wait, no. Who are you? Well, that was embarrassing. Brought to the ground by a couple of weak little bandits. Yeah, it is kind of embarrassing. had a plan too. I was going to charge in and catch them off guard. Take all the thinking out of it. Even if I failed to kill them quickly, I thought if I just stayed aggressive, I could keep them off balance and just push them over the edge. Well, yeah. Only I was the one who lost my balance. I tripped on the stairs on the way up. Just another instance of me being awkward. Story of my life. <laughs> Bounty hunter. In the heat of the battle, things happen. What happened after you tripped? That doesn't sound rather embarrassing. Oh, that does sound rather embarrassing and pathetic. No, let's not be rude. I fell over the edge before one of the bandits of all people pulled me back. <laughs> then the two of them started using my face as a target dummy. Oh my the gosh. The sad thing is, if we fought in an empty room, I could slay a dozen of these jesters. As clean and easy as the snow and frost fall. But out here, sometimes I feel like I'm fighting underwater. Nothing ever seems to go right. Huh. 
in any case I don't need your thanks I want your gold how about a reward you need to pay attention to your surroundings I have no room to talk about that are you all right if there's one thing I can handle it's a beating my sister Bertilde always said I was tougher than a mammoth and half as smart she was a real slaughterfish my sister people who are willing to tell the truth when it's cold and hard and naked on a fork they usually are it's okay. been a long time since I've seen her or my brother-in-law. Maybe it's time to stop adventuring and come back home. You know what? If we can... Um... Alright, whatever. Let's ask escort her. I need a companion. I need somebody to farm some I just soul gems and... To get my stamina back. I know it's hard to believe given what happened, but I'm a strong fighter. Okay. No! No. Uh. 